Hey, it's Colleen with Rope and Resellers, and I am here to show you uh, the bag that I get from the consignment store. This is actually a smaller bag, but I still pay $10 because it usually works out. It's, it's always, I can always make my money back, so I don't really worry about the investment. I'm starting to go through some of the stuff, and then I was like, you know what, I'm just going to show you the type of stuff that I would get from a consignment store. And this was all stuff that is going to go to a thrift store. So I just say I'm going to take it to the thrift store and she's like, okay, great, and take what you need out of it or what you can make money out of it and it's win-win. So anyway, the first thing is um, BKG and Company New York. I just looked this up. My daughter actually wants this. I think I could probably get 20 bucks for it. It's a full zip <coughs> sweater. There is the tag and um, it's she does a really good job of going through the stuff and making sure that it's all in good condition. So I really don't have to look for too many stains. I don't usually see that much. Next thing is just a little skirt. Um, Ann Taylor Petite. So there's Ann Taylor. And that uh, I looked up, and that's in a maybe. This my daughter also wanted. It's a um, H&M. It's cute. It's a small. I don't. I didn't even look it up. I haven't looked any of this up, but I just wanted to show you real quick what the kind of stuff that I get. So here's North Face. This is a women's plaid, and everybody knows North Face. Um, it's an outdoor clothing label. Super easy. Um, lightweight. This is kind of stretchy. Just a button down. I'm sure I can sell that one. This thing is a little weird. My daughter pulled this out. She went through it already. Oh, here's a tag. Bula. Oh, so it'll sell. Bula's an outdoor brand. Um, it's kind of weird. It's got these bones, and they're in this weird shape. But the material is stretchy. It feels like an uh, like a underlayer shirt. So I know that'll sell. Um, generally, I like to get at least twenty dollars. I don't. I have so many clothes that to list it for anything less than that at this point is a waste of time. So here's Charter Club, red jacket. Um, I don't, Charter Club is just Macy's brand. Uh, this one I looked up already, 600 West. It's, um, actually now that I pulled it out, it's not ridiculous, but the material on it is kind of plasticky looking, but this is the label, and I don't know a lot about that. Um, but it looked like that could be a $20 bill. This is Gossip, and I also don't know, see this is why I need to look all this stuff up, but this is just a women's shirt, size 14, there you go, um, it's a girl's shirt, I don't know anything about this brand, but there's that, let's try that again, so this is Talbot's vest, it's just a wool vest, and there is the brand label and it's so that's a possibility this is Liz Claiborne um, skirt it's a golf skirt so it's got the shorts underneath um, when a side zip they usually these sell pretty good for me but not this time of year soon this is a pair of Gap Men's size 3434 easy fit. I should probably get, I don't know. I don't even know. You know what? I don't even want to guess. This is why I don't like hauls. Um, I just want to show you about what I got in a consignment store bag. <clears throat> Calvin Klein jeans, men's, uh, straight 3232. Here's the back pocket. Pretty simple. Uh, I don't know if they'll sell. Usually men's clothes shall sell. I don't get a ton. Um, Coldwater Creek, I have mixed results with that. It's just a simple floral skirt. Um, I am thinking about lotting things up and selling them. This was a label I was not familiar with. Tasha Palazzi. Um, it's a zebra style print, but on the back, it, they're, it's new with tags. Um, but it has kind of a western look to it. Um, 
So there's that skirt. Here's Christopher Banks, which I have never sold. Christopher Banks. Um, size small. It's not a label I'm really familiar with. If I lock this stuff all up, then Puteyamo. Um, women's shirt, size small. Here is a Go sparkly butterfly shirt. That's got a butterfly on the back, but it's blinged out in front. Um, with like a burnout in it. Long sleeve t-shirt. I have no idea. Uh, this is missing its label, so I, uh, I guess I could probably figure it out. Maybe on the inside. Pima cotton made in Nicaragua. I don't know. Button down shirt. I'm surprised my daughter didn't grab this. And here are the pants. Bone pants by Bula. Bula. And these are just leggings, but they feel like long underwear type stretch leggings. Something Bula is is, is an outdoor brand. Um, counterparts. These are just black stretch, I don't know, yoga style, I guess, pants. There's some pilling on the bottom. And like I said, I'm not familiar with the label, so I don't know. And last but not least, this is an Oshkosh fleece sweat sweater. This, again, I, this is a small small bag. Usually she gives me, this is just a, like a kitchen size bag. Usually she gives me a big bag, but I actually, her husband gave me this huge bag a couple weeks ago that I went through and uh, pulled out some really good stuff. So it, it all evens out. Sometimes she gives me small bags and sometimes she gives me big bags, but that was, that's $10 from the consignment store. Still, I didn't have to source, so it saves me a ton of time and I'll You'll probably see that stuff, hopefully, as I list it and get it out of here. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.